Hello everybody, welcome here back to my channel. Welcome to another work week in my life. It is actually Tuesday today. I didn't vlog anything yesterday because Mondays are like my big content creation days. So I film like all of the reels we need for the next two weeks for Spread Social, um, our business that me and Sebastian have, and then like all of the graphics. I film YouTube videos for that week. It's kind of a lot. So if you guys would like to see kind of like a day in my life of just how I create content in like a batch form that we do, um, I can definitely do that video separately, um, but it was just like too much to include it <laughs> in a weekly vlog. So um, I'm starting this on a Tuesday. It is like 10 a.m. Um, I'm up, I'm showered. I got up pretty early today and then I just decided, you know what, I'm just gonna get ready and be ready for the day. So that's done out of the way. I'm trying to kind of plow through all of the work that I need to do today because later on um, this evening, I'm gonna go to my mom's house for dinner. Sebastian was gonna come with me, but it is Tuesday and usually those are his kind of like busier days. He loves to work, as you guys know, every single day until really late. <laughs> so he was gonna come with me, but um, he's just gonna stay here and I'm just gonna go, which I think is nice. Sometimes I don't think we share too much about like the importance of doing things on your own and like having space and stuff like that. And because me and Sebastian work together and live together and are married, all those things, like we enjoy being around each other, but we really have to work on giving each other space, <laughs> which is always like, I always feel bad saying that, but it's like so healthy and everyone needs it. So I'm gonna go do that today, which I'm so excited. I haven't seen my mom since Christmas. So it's been very busy and then this week on Thursday I have a hair appointment which I'm so excited my hair has just been like well for like months so gotta go do that on Thursday and yeah who knows what else we will get up to this week but I thought I would take you guys along with me and this week is gonna be a pretty standard week besides Thursday when I get my hair done this week has been interesting because I felt like last week was our first week back into the swing of things and I had like a little burst of motivation and then it kind of has slowly like fallen off i don't know why i wonder if anyone else is feeling like this but it's just like i'm so uninspired for some reason usually like the beginning of the year on youtube i have all these amazing ideas and i have all these things i want to do and like with work it's like i'm feeling inspired but at the same time it's like i have no original ideas i don't know what to post anymore i just feel like i'm in a slump so i'm making myself film today and film the rest of the week to kind of get back into things i don't know if it's just because I did vlogmas, maybe I'm, I don't know, my January TBR video that I just posted up, um, my last video, literally I had to film that three times and that never ever happened. I mean, sometimes I have to refilm things, but I've never filmed a video three times in a row. Like it was just so, every time I did it, I didn't know what I was saying or I didn't like the way it came out or I didn't like the lighting. Like it was just so weird. So I'm hoping that like, I don't know, I can get back into the groove of things and who knows, but um, I'm gonna go make some breakfast now. I made my coffee. I made it a little differently today. I saw on TikTok that people use like a little bit of heavy whipping cream and your creamer and then you like froth it up. So it was definitely frothy today today um it was very delicious i mean it tasted pretty normal but um it was really good but now i'm hungry so i'm gonna make some breakfast for myself it has been a busy few hours actually so that's very good and yeah sebastian's at the gym for the next little bit so i figured now's the time to um get some breakfast in me i don't know why i'm rambling but I've also been listening to, oh, sorry, <laughs> the Rachel Hollis podcast all day. I go through waves with her. Sometimes I really love like what she's sharing. Sometimes I feel like I can't really resonate with it. But this morning I was like, oh, she has a podcast about all about writing a book. <laughs> and like, I'm not gonna write a book, but <laughs> it just fascinates me how people are able to create these amazing stories and whatever. So I thought I would listen to it and it was so interesting. So now I'm just on a train and listen to all of our podcasts but i'm going to set you guys down make some breakfast for myself and then jump back into work and the swing of things Breakfast 
has been had. I'm about to do a big block of work for the next few hours. So I had to warm up my heating pad. If you didn't watch that video of my Christmas gifts that I love, oh, this is the best thing that I've ever had. I'm just gonna put it on my lap, cozy up. I have my smoothie that I need to start drinking and we're gonna get some work done. I just came downstairs because Sebastian oh. said I had hey, a new little package and this is from Culture Pop Soda. So sweet. They, yeah, have cute little sodas. So wild berry watermelon. I love watermelon. Um, ginger and lemon. Sebastian will probably like that one. I'm not a big ginger fan. And orange mango. And I just think they are the cutest bottles ever. So I don't know if they're like in stores or anything like that, but no. I j they are. You know what I just thought about? What? It's like pop culture. Yeah. You know, they're playing all with that. It's so cute. That's cool. Yeah, they're a cute little brand. So thank you guys so much for sending these out to me. We'll give them a try. I thought I would just share it because I think that is the cutest branding in the whole wide world. I want to like have a fridge full <laughs> of all of these. So we'll see how they taste. But Sebastian is home from the gym, so I'm going to make him a quick shake and then get back to work. It is 3 o'clock now. Finished up with the majority of my work. And now I need to do the dishes before I go because I want to make sure that I leave the house pretty clean um, so that tonight when I get back home from my mom's, I don't have to worry about it. So let's do some dishes. I'm on my way to go to my mom's. Do we remember when I used to do this once a week during Dancing with the Stars? Oh my God. Rest in peace, I will never watch that show again. And it's bringing back all the <laughs> memories of me doing that. Um, anyway, yeah, finished up work, feels really nice. Today was insanely busy and insanely quick. I don't know how it's already five, but I'm going to turn on the car. Sorry, but I'm freezing. And we will get started on our journey to my mom's house. Hello everyone and happy, what day is it? Wednesday. I didn't film anything last night after I got to my mom's, but it was so much fun. I got home at like 10 o'clock last night. I was just so, I didn't want to leave. I was having so much fun. So then that brings us to this morning, which I decided that I wanted to get up at 5.45 like Sebastian does. Now he is someone who he can go like to sleep at like 1 a.m. and still be able to get up <laughs> at 5.45 on time. He is still pretty tired, but he can like do it and he's totally fine. I woke up feeling like the shock of getting up early, but at the same time I was like, I'm okay, I'm fine. And I did have to film my um, morning routine, so that's why I didn't film anything like of this morning but so I did that I was feeling really good about it and then now it's like 11 30 and I am an absolute zombie <laughs> walking around here I'm just like there is nothing I can do to stay awake I just finished my coffee for this like for the day um so it's like I don't really need another cup of coffee because obviously I'm not feeling the benefits from this one maybe I need another one I don't know but I am just like so tired. I tried to have a snack thinking that would like wake me up. I cannot even be bothered to look at my computer today, which is something that like I love sharing kind of like, I don't know, like fun work clips and me like working on things and creating stuff and whatever. Um, because majority that's, you know, what I do majority of the time. But 
I think it's good to also share when you like cannot look at your computer without feeling like you're gonna vomit. <laughs> and today I'm just not in the mood for any work things. There's things that I've done this morning. Like there's always like four or five things that I have to get done every single day, which I did. Um, but now I'm like, okay, do I do the things that are gonna help like pursue me further in the week so things are not stressful or do I just go on TikTok? <laughs> and for the last 30 minutes i've only been on tiktok the good news hopefully sebastian is coming home from the gym he's just finishing up so he'll be home in just a little bit and i think we're gonna venture off and work at the coffee shop for the rest of the day i'm just thinking that will help because then um i can't fall asleep in a public space so hopefully it will help me get things done i don't know i'm just like not in it today i'm not feeling it i'm so tired usually it takes me a few days to like get used to something like I always wake up at 6 45 so it's just an hour difference but for some reason I'm feeling it and Sebastian actually is a little tired today too just because sorry I'm tying my pants <laughs> um just because yeah we had a late night we didn't go to sleep until like 11 45 so anyway I'm feeling it and if I have no energy today it's because I just can't and not even deal but yeah so this week will probably be a quiet one on the vlog so sorry about that but hopefully there's still some fun things to take you along with I did have to cancel my hair appointment because she's just not feeling well and in the climate that we're in it's like hair is not that important so you know <laughs> we'll stay our little distance um, so I'm not gonna get my hair done this week which I was sort of bummed about but now I'm just like it's fine like no one ever really sees me anyway and I mean on YouTube it like looks okay so we'll just we'll figure it out so that got canceled which is totally fine and then maybe tomorrow night instead i want to clean out this closet right here i used to have all of the books that i was reading on the little shelf but then i put it on my bookshelf as you guys know so it's just kind of like empty and like weird cluttered things are just kind of everywhere so I need to figure out that closet situation. I also want to run out to the store to get my push pins because I still haven't even like finished my dream board. It's just sitting on the ground. <laughs> so maybe that's why we're not off to a great start this uh, January, but I want to get that up on the wall. We'll see. Um, but as far as today goes, the goal is to just stay awake at this point. So. Oh my God, this is going to be sick. Do it, do it, do it. <laughs> I'm crossing my fingers for you. Did you do it? What the fuck? Go! Wait, where's it It's loading, it's loading, it's loading. It is? <gasps> oh my god. That's the moment our life changed forever. <laughs> We're gonna look back on this video in a year and we'll be famous. <laughs> and millionaires. Millionaires, famous. What if this video disqualifies us? From, because you know? Yeah. Nah, I'll post it. I was gonna go. <laughs> no, they're not gonna go back. It is five o'clock, which is why the lighting is gonna be super orange and yellow. But I've just been editing my morning routine. I had a pop tart and I survived the afternoon. I didn't fall asleep and the coffee shop was great. As you guys saw, Sebastian um, officially applied for a survivor. <laughs> so who knows? Um, the minute after, we were like, oh my god, it feels like you're about to leave. Um, to go do this but who knows it's just if anything it's just like a fun silly thing that we wanted to do if it happens great if not we'll keep trying right you'll keep applying every year yeah <laughs> um so yeah anyway i am done with work for the day it is date night tonight and we are going to do we don't know yet actually we've kind of been floating around some sort of plans we have a couple of shelves that we want to install tonight so if that doesn't sound like a date night then <laughs> i don't know what does these days but and then we'll probably make dinner here and that will be that so you ready to be done for the day oh this lighting is nice it's nice scoochy 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 yeah so these are the shelves that we're gonna put in sebastian's Oh my god, I'm not ready for this. No, Sebastian's like, we'll just do it for an hour. We're gonna be here until 8 o'clock doing one shelf. And then we have another shelf that we want to put downstairs. It's the same one. So, so cute, but I don't think it's gonna take us an hour. Yeah, <laughs> oh my god, look at the sun! Mm -hmm. <gasps> the birds! Let's dance with the sunset. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> I want to wear like a teen tiger. Cause like when you're in your little chair, you're gonna hit your head. Are you mm. moving the chair? No. Nothing better than not figuring out <laughs> how to do things <laughs> with some wine and some calls to your stepdad, huh? <laughs> One day we'll get this. Got the shelf up. <laughs> we need some decor, <laughs> but Jesus Christ. but she's up. It literally. <laughs> that's so bad. It's okay. Oh my god, that's so bad. Well, how are we gonna fix it? I we literally have to take everything off. We have to redo everything. Are we going to? No. <laughs> Sturdied it out. We got some help from some family members. And look at it. It looks so good, baby. Does We're going to get him, of course, some other things. This is just what we have right now. Everything's going to be changed. <laughs> We're going to get a little, why? what is that called? Leaf that's like hanging off the side, which I think will be cute. But other than that, it's up. Let's cross our fingers. It will still be here in the morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Thursday. It's been a rough one <laughs> so far. Not really, but it is 8 o'clock. I just finished up my voiceover and last like final edits for my morning routine. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that because I did get up early <laughs> to finish it. Not that that's why you need to enjoy my videos, but hopefully the voiceover sounded okay for you guys. I was so tired doing it and it was like early in the morning <laughs> so it gave it a nice like relaxing feel um it's almost eight o'clock now so that is just like exporting i will upload it in about an hour and i have my coffee here i didn't do the fancy um tiktok coffee today it's just a little bit of creamer but our fridge has like stopped making ice i don't know why i think we have to like change a filter or something so we ordered that yesterday so it's like weird to like not have ice in my coffee but anyway it's still good and i'm taking a little bit of time today to read so normally i read like a business book or a self-help book in the morning but i need to finish this book if i want to be on track i need to finish this book by today which I don't think it's gonna happen <laughs> but if i can get a good chunk in today then maybe i can finish tomorrow so i'm only like one day off um we'll see but i'm really loving it it's the extremely loud and incredibly close and i just read this page all about like the history of the empire state building and i just love how so many books so many movies just like romanticize new york like oh, i just love it this book is like set in new york and i just love that like it just makes me so happy and so it's been fun to read this book like for the story but also for just like the little like love letters that they throw into new york city it just makes me so happy and that's why i have always been obsessed with the city so anyway reading that this morning like just really made me smile so anywho i'm gonna continue on reading um i just thought i would open up the vlog today uh last night was great we just stayed at home and we watched a movie together and that was it so we were pretty tired as you guys know um but we got the shelf up which is nice and then tonight we're gonna go over to fashion's mom's house to hang out with the sisters so that will be fun i'm hoping i have like good energy for that <laughs> um trying to be a little bit quiet i think sebastian is meditating and usually when he meditates he always falls asleep so he's always sleeping on the floor <laughs> in his office um but i'm gonna take this quiet time to finish up um hopefully a few good pages um in this book so that i'm not super behind not gonna lie to you guys i may have sat down to take the teensiest little nap. Um, I don't feel refreshed. <laughs> I don't think it helps me. Hopefully this angle is okay. Um, I'm just getting ready now because we are about to leave in just a little bit to go to Sebastian's mom's house because we're going to, did I tell you guys already? We're gonna hang out with his sisters. So that will be fun um i'm looking a mess i'm looking a mess yeah i just kind of you know like when you go to lay down because you're like okay i have like oh that's gonna bug me a little bit of time before i have to like you know go and get ready i'll just lie down for just a little bit and then you're thinking about all the other things you could be doing besides sitting down <laughs> 
so I just couldn't get comfy, but I didn't get out of bed, so I still wasn't productive. Um, Sebastian's home now. He just got a haircut. Lucky him, because mine got canceled today. <laughs> um, and yeah, so he's home now, and then we'll be on our way out the door. I'm just doing like the worst curls in the history of curls, probably just doing it very quickly. It's so funny, if you follow me on Instagram, I shared a while ago of like this new method of how to curl your hair that's like super cute beachy waves and I made like a reel about it and for like three days I did it so perfectly and so cute and lately I just feel like my curls have not been good so I don't know if I like lost it, forgot how to do it, I need a new method, I don't know I'm just kind of like ugh, with my hair right now so anyway I was gonna talk, stop I knew you're home that scared me. Then why did you know? <gasps> Look at his handsome head. Hey. I'm all finished getting ready now, and I literally did the thing where I do one pump of foundation, and then I get too lazy, so everything else is like leftover <laughs> bronzer that's already on the brush, leftover blush. But we got the job done, so <laughs> I'm feeling much better now that I'm um, somewhat ready for the day, and I'm really looking forward to going out and leaving. It's nice to have something to do these days, and I think we're gonna make some nachos. We're gonna do a paint night. Night. Um, Sebastian's parents have the uh, VR, no, yeah, VR, the little game. <laughs> um, and the last few times we've done it, me and Sebastian have gotten so, like, not sick, but just like uneasy from it. Um, but I think we just needed to get used to it because we did it on Sunday, I think. Yeah, it was Sunday. And it was so fun. So. We're probably gonna play a little bit of that, and regardless, it'll just be fun to hang out with my family. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. this one. I did this one. That's a good one. Okay. Yeah, yeah this one's good. Yeah, that one's sick. Honestly, you're good. <laughs> Good morning, you guys, and welcome to Friday. We have made it the end of the week. I'm feeling so good. I'm like whipping through my to-do list, which feels so good. So um, I just got a tiny bit dressed because I'm about to go run to Target because this is silly, but I really wanna get the push pins um, for my dream board and just like some other maybe like pretty tape to put around. I don't know, I just need to like fill in the awkward um, like empty spaces basically i'm gonna put you guys over here so yeah that's why i kind of still look a mess but um i'm just gonna quickly run in and then there probably won't be anything but i really want to look at the dollar section i feel like tons of people have been sharing these cute little things um but that was like last week so who knows what it will be like but i just feel like going to target so i'm gonna do that right now um and then yeah we'll be back home i have if you watch my morning routine i had to do this um, kind of like, it's like this Amazon call with one of their representatives and so I need to do that with them but then they had to reschedule on like Tuesday or Wednesday, I can't remember. So that is today around like 2.30 so hopefully that just gets done and out of the way. Um, and then I finished my book this morning so that means I'm on track thankfully. Um, it was a really good book. It was extremely loud and incredibly close. I've talked about it here and there a little bit but all in all, it was a really good book. So now I'm gonna be starting the Divergent series. I'm excited for that. I think it'll be nice. A nice little switch up. The extremely loud and incredibly close book was um, kind of more like a heartfelt, like there were some really sad moments and it was just more of like a true adult novel where Divergent is just like a fun fantasy YA series. And so I'm excited to just like chill out, dive into that. Um, I can show you the, I'm like switching gears, but I can show you the canvas I painted last night. Here it is. I decided to do, it doesn't really look like cheetah print because I didn't intend for it to be cheetah print. At first I just wanted to do like the 
kind of tan background and then I figured I would just figure out what I wanted to do next. And then I kind of tried to make a cheetah. It's not like, I don't know, officially cheetah print, but it just looks like spotty and cute. So I put it here on my bookshelf and I actually put up like a couple stories of us doing that last night. And so many of you were like, oh my gosh, this is a great idea. I want to do that. So if you want to do something safe and fun with your family, definitely do a paint night. We are not <laughs> good at all. Like Sebastian's little sister, she is like, a true artist. People pay her to do murals and tattoos and artwork and all these things. So she's like legit good and all of us are just like not very good. Um, but it's still so much fun and everyone's turned out really nice. I can show you Sebastian's. He is like a little hidden artist I think as well. Um, he just did, oh where is it? This fine line face which I feel like is so cool. So that's what we did last night. It was very fun and yeah. I should probably stop rambling so that I can get this errand done and then get back home. But regardless, we are feeling good, feeling fresh. We still haven't heard back from Survivor, in case you guys are wondering. <laughs> um, I don't know how long that would take or if they tell us if he didn't make it in or if we just don't hear from them, we'll see. But we keep thinking like one of these days it might happen. So I'll keep you guys posted if I can for sure. But yeah. That is Friday. We have no plans tonight. I have so much laundry to do. I wish I could show you my bedroom. Um, it is an absolute <laughs> disaster and mess. So tonight we'll just be chilling out. There won't really be anything for us to do, but that's okay. Um, it'll be nice to be home. And yeah, I'm gonna put my shoes on, get in the car, and then I'll probably catch up with you guys once I'm out of Target to show you what I found. Home now, as promised, I'll show you a couple of the things I picked up. Session. I just feel like I hear someone. Nothing too exciting, but the push pins that I found were these U Brands push pins. And they're like cute rose gold, and then they just have a clear little bobble on the top, which I think will work perfectly. And then I am such a freak and have been enjoying cleaning so much that this excited me so, so much. So it's a Dawn Ultra Platinum Power Wash Dish Spray. I don't know why I needed it, but I was like, this would be gorgeous to clean <laughs> my sink with. So I got that and then I found, um, I always love to do a little something for Sebastian. Like we don't really go all out for Valentine's Day, um, but I love to do just like a little something. So I found this like little pail. I thought I would like fill it with some fun things. And then I also found these like hands-free tools that you like put on to your keys or something. And then you can like pull doors open and stuff and press buttons and all of the safe things. So I got a couple, um, one for me, one for Sebastian. I'll probably put it in here. I know Valentine's Day is like a ways away, but I figured they were there. It'd be like a cute little thing. Um, and that's it. That's all I got. So a nice, um, productive target run. And then I'll be able to do my dream board tonight, which I'm excited about and kind of get that up and have it to look at. Um, but now I'm going to hop back on my computer, work for the rest of the afternoon, and then I'll catch you guys up probably this evening when we do something a little bit different other than just working. Ignore the multiple coffee tables I feel like we have in here. We're still trying to sell this one. So fingers crossed we can get it out of our hair by this weekend, but um, there's been a change of plans. I was gonna go upstairs and work, like I told you guys, but I was like, you know what? It's Friday today. I have a lot of things done and I figure, you know what? I didn't make an effort to work out this morning. Let's do it now. So that's what I'm gonna do. I've been kind of in a like unmotivated slump with my workout. Um, I don't wanna do any of the Sydney Cummings workout. I usually love her, but I'm just like over it. I'm bored of it. I feel like I've done all of them. And so I don't know, I've kind of been doing like more yoga workouts. Um, so <laughs> I don't know. I never feel like amazing like i just worked out so hardcore after i do yoga even though i know it is like very hard it's hard for me at least but i just never get that like feeling you know so it never makes me feel like i'm doing the most but then at the same time i'd rather do that than nothing so kind of my compromise here is i think i'm gonna do like an at-home pilates workout maybe I don't know, we'll see. I just feel like if you are also in like a workout slump because we've been working out for home, at home um, essentially for like a year, I feel like just research some new workouts and see if you can find one that you like. I've just been in the same slump of just like doing the Sydney Cummings workouts, which I do like, but 
I'm needing something else. So I think I'm gonna do that for the next like 30 minutes and then get ready for the day and then get back to work. So let's do it. Okay, so I finished putting it all together. The plan is to have it under my little shelf here. I don't know if that's gonna look weird, but I feel like it would be cute there, um, just kind of when we've like tested it out. So once Sebastian gets back home, then I will have him help me put it up. But I think it's really, really cute. I just put a few things. I think as the year goes on, it'll be fun to get like stickers or, you know, things that like we've maybe done this year that I can print out. I don't know. <laughs> but for the most part, um, this is kind of what it looks like. I'm really happy with it and it'll be nice when it's all up hopefully um, later tonight. Mm -hmm. 